variety. We got a couple candy vending machines here, and this is the Pringles machine. Did they have new flavors? Yes, they do. Definitely got to check that out. Yes, they do. All right, you got to play the game. You either get one, two, or three. I've only ever gotten one before, so yeah, that's what I'm assuming it's gonna be, but we're here for the new flavors. Come on. Bump. And what is it? Cheese. Okay, can't go wrong with cheese. There's others in here though. Definitely gotta get something different. Okay, money in. Sound Kim Poi. Rock, paper, scissors, is that what it is? Oh yeah, one. Loser, loser, loser. There we go. It's good as long as it's a different one. Ooh, it's a premium flavor. Okay, nice. Nice, nice. And there's other different flavors in there too. Let's go to do it once more. One more go. All right. It'd be awesome if we hit a three, wouldn't it? it never happens. Oh, we got two. Oh, that's a first. That's a first. Two for the price of one. Oh yeah, another cheese. That's not what we wanted. Ringer. Okay, good, this one, the center one's moving. Oh man, too much Ringer. cheese. <laughs> so we tried the chupa chops. It says for 200 yen, you get between five and seven of the suckers. That sounds like a pretty good deal. Let's do that. Hit the stop button. Four of them, that's pretty good. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Oh yeah, it takes them up the ladder. Very cool. Nice. I like that, huh? Up the ladder you go. music huh oh yeah four for 200 and we got the mini mentos machine here never done this one before you get between i don't know how many you get I'm not sure same thing 200 yen gotta do it oh this is groovy Five, that's pretty good. There they are, going up. Oh yeah, love the groovy ladder, pulling them up. Oh yeah, get some. Pretty cool machines, for sure. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like a winner. Oh yeah, get some! Alrighty, we are in the car. Look who's driving her, buddy. What's your name? Mega Man 600. That's right. And we are headed to a new vending machine somewhere around here. We're not exactly sure where it is. We're at this big shopping center right now, but they sell all kinds of stuff. Yeah, I hope we can find it. So we've been driving for about, what, 20 minutes? You have any idea where this place is? I have no idea. Yeah, it's so dark. <laughs> We're actually, we're going to a factory, right? I believe it's like they have 
meats and stuff that they sell, and it's right outside of the factory is where the vending machine is supposed to be. So this is a like a industrial area around here, big factories. Huh. This is the first time we've done a vending machines video at night, huh? Down that, that's an even darker street. <laughs> oh yeah, score. He's parked, he's inside the white line. <laughs> Only took him 20 minutes, all right. So here's a look at the factory and the delivery trucks. Yep, but come on, let's see what the machines got happening here. So it's all meat stuff, huh, or fish. This is shirasu fish, white bait fish. Ooh, they got, what is that, a pork sandwich? That looks really good. With original sauce, okay. Is that a chicken curry, is it? All kinds of stuff here. What kind of seafood here. Mixed seafood, it's nice. And got some gyoza down here on the bottom. Pretty nice, it's a good looking machine. Is everything available? Yep, looks like everything's available. That's good. You got the money? Yep. All right, let's just get one of everything. They're all different, we've never had any of them, except for gyoza, but I mean, it's a factory, so they're probably gonna be different, right? Yeah. Okay, go for it. The lighting's tricky here. I'll do my best. Curry? Yep. Okay, so this is the regular curry first. Okay, a couple different packages, huh? Okay, next. Chicken katsu. Chicken katsu, oh yeah, definitely get that. Number three. Yeah, nicely packed. That looks really good. Okay. What's next? Next is buttered chicken curry. Chicken curry. That looks good. Chicken curry coming out. Oh, it looks buttery, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh yeah, it looks nice. Shirasu, this Nama, little. Nama oh, okay, this is raw white bait fish from this area here. Okay, I trust it if it comes from the factory. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Like it's got the waves on it. That's pretty cool. Okay, nice. The local catch. And Kaisen this one. Don. Kaisen don. This is raw fish over rice. The rice you gotta buy yourself. You're just getting the fish part. But you get quite a bunch of different kinds of fish. Look at all those types of fish. Money in, you, you good? Nice. Uh, this one's 1300 and you get two and, packs. And there's salmon too. Oh, there's salmon too. Okay, so yeah, it's a mixed pack. Okay. Oh, there's the salmon, huh? Yep. Okay. Oh, it looks delish. Fresh fish from a vending machine. Oh, -hoo -hoo. look at how juicy these dumplings are, according to the picture. Yeah? Yeah. Really juicy. Uh-huh. Hit it. Oh yeah. Ooh, it's got garlic, niniku. Garlic dumplings. 
So the name of the company is Fuji Kitchen. See, just as we're leaving, somebody else comes up and it's like there's nobody around here for like miles. Nobody around here. It's just all big factories. Yeah, it's a great place for a vending machine. All right, so we are back. Are you ready to eat? I'm ready to eat. Ready to eat. All right, where are we going to start? Let's have something to drink first, shall we? Okay. What do you got there? I'm just having water. I have yuzu and honey sour. Oh, okay. Cocktail, huh? Yeah. Cheers. Yuzu and honey? Yeah. Yuzu and honey sour. Interesting. What does it taste like? Let me have a hit. All right. Ooh, that's good. That's really good. I should be having one of those. It's only 3% alcohol, so yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> Pretty mellow. And yuzu, of course, is a citrus drink. Yeah, citrusy. It's good. All right, so what are we going to start with tonight? You want to choose? Yeah. Okay. The gyoza. The gyoza. Good choice. I was smelling a lot of garlic when the gyoza was cooking. In fact, so much so that I had to open the window and it is cold outside tonight. Yes, very garlicky, I'm thinking. And this is a sauce for it, is that right? That's right. Okay. Let's go. Get in there. Get all the dumplings from a vending machine. Oh yeah. Mmm. -hmm. Mm. Taste the garlic. Oh, these are meaty. I don't know what kind of meat that is inside there. You think pork? Pork kind of the standard, isn't it? And then it's got these uh, these green things. What do you call those things? What do you call those things? A focus. What do you call those green things? A chives. Leeks. Okay. Moving on, I'm gonna have some of the chef salad here. We've got some beautiful looking mushrooms on top. Homemade dressing as well too. Creamy dressing, it looks kind of like ranch. Eat it like a mouse. E to daki mouse. I said the eat to daki a little late though, didn't I? Yeah. I'm supposed to do that before you eat. I should have been before the gyoza. Yeah. So properly, you say itadakimasu, like that, before you eat, right? That's right. And before you drink, you say kanpai. And if it's hard to say itadakimasu, then itadakimasu, they sound so similar if you say it fast. Yes, they do. What do you think of the salad dressing? It's banging. Yeah, it's good dress. Did you put it on? Did you put any dressing on there? I did. Like a tangy ranch dressing. Okay, moving on. You're up. Where are you gonna go? Who are you gonna call? Ghostbusters. <laughs> the katsu sandwich. The katsu sandwich. Okay, and I guess they've got sauce on them already. Let's open one up so you guys can see it. It does have sauce on it. On the ground it goes. <laughs> oh, what we go through for the close-ups. This is delicious. That is really good. Tasty. Yeah. It's a really juicy pork, isn't it? No. Yeah. Mmm. Mm-mm. And a good breading. That was a good choice. Wow. It's I wasn't expecting this good a quality from a vending machine. I've been seeing these recently in vending machines, but this is the best one so far. And even the bread is nice and soft. Let's go for the the fancy one first, shall we? Okay, and this is the Kai Sendong, so it's mixed. It's mostly salmon, huh? But there's other fish in here as well, too. We need shoyu. You can put shoyu on top? Yeah. Okay. And we'll just share the bowl, so I'll hold it and just go in. Mm-hmm. 
fatty salmon, isn't it? You know. Mmm. That is delicious. Nice texture. This is some Ika squid right here. I'm going to get some uh, rice. So this is served over rice. It's basically a fish bowl. What do you call it? Sashimi bowl. In Japanese, it's called kaisendon. I'm going to do some salmon. Some wasabi. There's a lot of wasabi over here in the corner. A lot. Salmon, slimy seaweed, wasabi. There's some shrimp in there too. Cooked shrimp, it looks like. Well, that's pretty tasty. That's really good stuff. Yeah. For sure. The fatty salmon is the most expensive one. And I even like the wakame, the seaweed, the slimy seaweed on top. Yeah. I didn't used to like it, but like wakame style, right? Your choice? Shirasu. Oh, that's a bold choice. The <laughs> shirasu fish. So the shirasu fish is a delicacy in this area, in the Shonan beach area where we live. And you can eat it raw or you can have it cooked, right? It's the white bait, tiny little fish. And this is raw tonight. Can I hit it with the show you? Yeah. Yeah, raw little white bait fish. I'm not sure how I feel about this. I've had it before. And this is served over rice. Have you had it before, the raw? I had it once. Once? Yeah. Did you like it? I like it. You like it? Okay, well that's good. That was a pretty good sized bite. And this has also got a side of wasabi. I'm gonna hit it with some wasabi. You think it's fresh? It's good? Does it have any flavor? It's kind of gooey, right? It's fishy. Fishy. <laughs> Too much wasabi. Oh, it must have be strong. I can't even taste the fish. Let me just try some fish. It's fishy, but the shoyu covers it pretty nicely. I don't know. It's kind of a gooey mess. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, meh. I'm not sure how I feel about that, but it is a delicacy in this area, so we buy it when it's in season, for sure. And, uh, yeah, I think pe people know it pretty well, shirasu white bait fish. It's a big deal around here, so got to eat it. You know, I like it cooked, though. Cooked, it tastes nice. Yeah, it's very Salted. All right, let's move in for the curries. We've got two different types. There's a chicken curry, and is that the butter? I'm not even sure. Do you know what the difference is? I think it's uh, nor normal. Okay. This one's. All right. So you start on that one. I'll start on this one, and then we'll switch. Okay. Okay. So with the serving of rice, I guess this is the butter chicken. I can see the butter in it. You okay. Spoon. All right. We got some uh, good spoons. That'll work. Do the curry first. Not what that has meat. You know what kind of meat that is. Not sure? Not sure. Okay. It's spicy, this one. Spicy. This is not spicy at all. It's very rich, buttery. <laughs> Butter chicken, it's the standard. Mm hmm. Good. Pretty tasty. And the chicken's really nice too. Good taste, good flavor on the chicken. Well, yours is spicy, you're saying, huh? Yeah. <clears throat> okay, I'm gonna try. Okay. I'm gonna swap them. More spicy kind of curry, huh? All right. Oh, it is spicy. Kind of similar though, it's like butter. Yeah. Very buttery. Yeah. So, yeah, kind of I mean, Indian style, right? It's not really Japanese style, right? 
It's a, it's a very rich curry. Yeah, it's different. Thick. It's different, right? Yeah. And then uh, we've got kind of some snacks and some dessert that I also got from the vending machine. So Pringles, two different types. One's cheese, and this is that the secret one. Do you know what that one is? Kurotorif. Black something. Torif is trifle. Yeah. Oh, the trifles. So that's oh, it's like the made from mushrooms kind of Tri yeah. trifles. Well, it's supposed to be good. Trifle. These are very white, and those are very cheesy. Should we show them what the insides look like? Oh, it's just like mushroom. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh, this is powerful. Not what I was expecting. Oh my goodness. Oh. This is very good. You like the cheese? Oh, yeah. Oh, it's easy. This is, I think a kid would probably spit this out. <laughs> Oh, I don't know about that. The cheese. Oh yeah. Bursting with flavor. <laughs> Not weird. This is weird. Like a mushroom, mushroom coat. It really tastes like a mushroom, doesn't it? Yeah. And it's not all that salty like this. This is, the cheese is really like a sharp <laughs> cheddar, I think. There's a Parmesan on top too. It was very cheesy. One cheese and two of the trifle. Oh! <laughs> oh, these are rough. Oh, if you guys ever have a chance to eat these or avoid these at all costs, unless you're a trifle fan, I guess. Oh my goodness. What a shock. All right, and next up we got some Mentos. And these come from the local shopping center, right? It's sort of a game you play and you either get, what did, it's kind of hard to tell how many you're gonna get. But this this is 200 yen, so you get five. Bit of a rip off. What flavor <laughs> you wanna go for? Strawberry. You got strawberry? Okay. There's another strawberry as well too. Um, green apple. I'm gonna do the green apple. Mentos. Not really a candy. I've spent more time doing things with Mentos and not eating them. <laughs> Putting them into that Coke. I've, I've spent more time <laughs> with than I have actually Popping them in my mouth. Oh, they're hard. That's my gripe with Mentos. They're too hard. I mean, they do get soft after a while, but getting through that hard shell is tough, right? Yeah. Well, good though. And then we've got the world famous Chupa Chups. There's three cola flavor and one Mekon Mandarin Orange flavor. What's it gonna be? We will suck on these while we ponder what our rating is gonna be for this meal. Okay. Huh? Cola. Cola. <coughs> cola flavored sucker. Lollipop. All right. Coal is like a popular flavor in Japan for candy, isn't it? Yeah. Beautiful, like a lollipop, huh? This is my first time to review a lollipop. All right, to the cola. Mmm, 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 mmm. Blows away the Mentos, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. I wasn't expecting much, but this is killer. Oh my gosh, right? This is really good. Mm-hmm. Oh my. Wow. Wow. Really good. Chupa good. Chups. And I've had some of the other flavors as well, too. They are good. All right, so there it was. Another round of vending machine food. 
And this is a pretty interesting one, right? Meats, basically fish and meats vending machine. That one machine sold all that stuff. And then the candy I got at uh, our local shopping center. It's called uh, Olympic. So I was hoping I could get some different flavors for the, the chips, but nope, I only got the two. So, but Pringles does change the flavors quite often in Japan. So when they do, I, I always like to try the new ones. And this, the trifle, oh my goodness. We're not even going to talk about that. <laughs> <laughs> so where are you going to go? Rating. Fish, curry, we got the dumplings. I'm going to go five. Five out of six, that's pretty high. Pretty high, five out of six. I'm thinking all around. Five out of six. We're pretty much the same on the ratings. That really? Yeah. Five out of six. So there you go. It's a num num or it's banging. Right? It's banging. It's banging. So we want to thank you guys for watching. Slap a like on the video if you enjoyed it. And as always, we look forward to reading those comments. And we shall see you in the next one. Eric and Mega Allen.